Hey guys, Ricardo here and welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. And for today's tutorial, we're looking at any Windows 10 or Windows browser not responding. This could be any browser including Firefox, Google Chrome or any other browser that you use. Now, these errors where it's not responding may vary. For example, this is a common one that you might encounter where it says warning, unresponsive script. Scripts on this page is busy, it may I've stopped responding. You can stop the script now or you can continue to see if the scripts will complete. Otherwise, you might have issues where in general the browser may just freeze up. And when the browser freezes, when you try to interact with the screen, it basically gives you a sound or it doesn't move. Something sounding like this where it doesn't respond any at all. Now, in these cases, I'm going to show you what you can do to fix the issue. Now, regardless of the browser, let's get started. All right. So the first thing you want to do, if you get a visible message where it gives you the option to continue or stop scripts, the option is yours. You can choose to continue and wait and see if the issue will correct itself. Well, in most cases, I would advise you do not use continue. You go ahead and hit stop script. Now, stopping the script might just be what is needed to get the browser working once more. Once the script has stopped, relaunch your browser. Um, in other cases, the browser might be totally unresponsive where it's not minimizing or not responding at all. Now for this, I suggest that you get your cursor, rest it on the taskbar as seen down here. So here you have your taskbar, then you're gonna um, right click on the taskbar. Once you do that, you should see this menu. And this is in cases where the browser is totally unresponsive. Go ahead and go to Task Manager. Once you're in Task Manager, just wait until the screen loads. Um, in my case, I have two screens, so I'm just going to bring this over. And here it will show you a bunch of stuff that's running. And it should populate, and the main app should show up here. Say, for example, I have Firefox um, running right here, where it's unresponsive. And of course, no matter how I try to close it, it will not close. So simply highlight the browser, Firefox, it could be Chrome or any other browser. Once you highlight, go ahead and hit end task. So for example, over here, I'll try to show you my browser. All right, so as you can see here, guys, I don't want to show you my entire tab, but my browser is now open over here, but it's not responding. So if I click, you might hear a ping sound. All right, so as you see over here, what I'm going to do right now is I'm just going to end task. So once you hit end task, go ahead. As you see there, the process itself will be closed out. And all you have to do in those cases is simply close the task manager. Once class manager is closed, simply find the um, app again, such as the browser, as you're seeing here. Just give me a second. And here we have Firefox, which was unresponsive. Let's go ahead again and launch. And as you can see here, um, the browser has loaded fully. And it's once again responsive. So as you can see here, I can do several things, including go to any website. So I'm just going to click on a website link. And notice once it was not responsive, but now it's fully responsive again. So it's simply a matter of browsers, the scripts will stop. You simply need to force close the browser using Task Manager. If you do not use the Task Manager to end the process, it will hang indefinitely and you'll never be able to use your um, device. Now, the third and final step, if all else fails, is to give your PC a reboot. Now, um, most people do not reboot their PC and as a result, if you have your PC on for days at a time or months at a time, it can cause issues. So just go ahead and simply go to the Start menu. So let me just minimize right here. Then you're going to go to the start. Once you're in start over here, depending on the speed of your PC, or it might be responding slowly, simply go ahead and um, turn off your PC or restart. I recommend a full shutdown. So go ahead and completely shut down. I'm not going to shut this down. But of course, once you reboot, uh, you can have all the apps refresh. You can relaunch your browser again once more. It's also a good idea to clean your PC so if you have a cleaning tool, such as the one I use here, which is CC Cleaner or any other PC maintenance tool, go ahead and clear the cache of your browsers or so on. By doing that, it will give your browsers a fresh restart. But do note that clearing the cache can also log you out of many websites. 
So you may want to check which websites you need to be logged into and make sure that you remember the login details. Doing all this should fix the issue with your PC and also um, return your browser as being fully responsive so you can start browsing again. I hope this was useful. If it was, please go ahead and give us a thumbs up. This is Ricardo Gardner as usual from Blog Tech Tips showing you how to fix um, issues relating to your um, browser on your Windows 10 or other Windows PC. Regardless, to say until next time. Bye.